Hey, how's it going? Taco Monkey here, and I'm bringing you another video for Elden Ring. Uh, this is my Blood Bead, Blood Bleed build, and uh, we're gonna go around crossing some uh, T's and dotting some I's. So, I changed my guy a little bit as far as armor goes. I'm sorting that beautiful, sweet veteran armor. Uh, veteran's armor has some good abilities uh, as far as strength and, and uh, good damage negation from magic, which I'm, I'm loving. And sticking with the white mask because, well, we're a bleed build. Uh, I have got the Lord's Blood of Exaltation now, um, the Great Shield Talisman, the Godfrey Icon, and the Rotten Wing Sword Insignia going now. Now we will be switching off with uh, Godskin Pillar does some sweet damage. Where's the blood? Uh, just in case I want to switch it up, I got that for the DLC. Um, I got the Blood Ass Ansper Rapier because I was just interested in seeing what the Scarlet Build and Blood Build will do. Blessmas Blade I just collected. That's all the way leveled up. Um, dual Rickety Shields because, you know, sometimes you want to have fun. And uh, that's about it. I also upgraded the horn bow a little bit now that I got a little bit of a range if I so choose. And it makes your arrows magic when you use this. Uh, you can get this down underneath in the uh, Sophia River area. It's, it's pretty much right oh, that's mimicked here. The river bank, you go over here, it's right under these stairs right here. So um, from going down from the well, Sophia River Bank. Anywho we're going to go here where we're at now, which is the War Dead Catacombs. We're going to check this out, go through, um, get a few things I wanted to grab, and keep moving on. See how the, the uh, build racks up. I also put on um, the Infinite FP uh, flask, and I got the Exalted Flesh. I've got a few, a few of those. It's been working pretty good so far. Uh, being able to do this forever is awesome. Already doesn't take much FP as it is, so these guys uh, pretty much killed each other, so I let them do their thing. Even if you can't get the bleed proc, this thing is just awesome itself. It does great poise damage. Just great. Wondrous poise damage. Love it, love it, love it. Good stuff. Uh, no, not yet. That isn't the window we're looking for. I can't remember. Uh, we'll go this way first. Yeah, I can do that too.
sure all the uh, secret places are open with America's or Mar Margaret's Margaret's shekel. So I'll open up all the windows and doors. Yeah, this is the one I was looking for. on that one in a while. So even after you get that, don't jump down there just yet. Radon, uh, Radon soldier ashes. It's not bad. And it was, oh, yeah. yourself dude This wheel's holding up pretty good. Not bad, not bad, my boy, not bad. big problem is I can't exactly remember where that door is that opens up. Oh yeah, it was down here. Pretty simple. Well, seeing as I only have one flask and I'm doing pretty bad, I'm just going to go ahead and go back and reset everything. That's all you got to do, really. Pretty fun. Uh, not a bad area. I'm I'm 
probably see uh, this build, we're at level 149. I'm hearing a lot of people are going to be up to 200 uh, for the DLC. I don't know if I'll be that high. I feel like that's a little high. Maybe like maybe 160, 175 tops. I feel like new 70, 175 is probably going to be the new meta. Personally, but we'll see. I did that. It took way too long to do that. This guy never lets you pull that off. That would suck. Oh, those bots are pretty powerful. Can I get a finisher? Yeah. Look at that, just melts away. Then we got Remain Knight Ogus. Oga? Nice. Sweet. Not bad, that's taken care of. Um, I think I had a beast. That's a little beast thing to turn in, pretty sure. Oh, I got these new caramel, uh, what is this? Caramel cold brew McDonald's, um, or M&M's. Um, They're awesome, I love them. Oh no? Oh, I thought I had I had one to turn in, okay. Oh, whatever. Alright, so most of this is what I wanted to be done is done. I still got him left though. How do we get to him? Probably from Dragon Far out West. I don't even know what he is. Remember I got that tower to do. Should do that soonish. Cold dragons to take care of over here. I love this thing, it's like a lawnmower, just fucking woof. Flipping guys left and right, it's great. Oh, we took minimum damage, minimal damage. Oh, who's right there? Oh, I chose poorly. I, I missed him. Ah. Alright, go back. How did I do that? How the heck did I do that? I guess I just had to go this way. Down.
Oh, that's why. You do have to go down past the dragons. Okay. All right, all right. We can do this. Man, I can't believe less than two weeks for this DLC is going to be wicked. Uh, it's just going to be great. And my character is just right so we can start the DLC right off the bat, right when it comes out. Man, if they said early access, I would have paid the money for it, uh, to be honest. All right, let's see. Oh, bounce. Huh. Well, that was pretty easy. I have to bounce me to choose. Nice. Yeah, that, that combo is wicked. That is wicked. Okay, so that guy's done. Let's see. I have a lot of borrow like places I still need to go. I should get I should do this just cause. Uh I really don't want to. Here, let's first spend a runes. Whenever we get up to like 100,000 or more, I always just go back to here and just get some kills and be done with it. I mean, it's just good business. Missing isn't good business, but... That just does such great damage. I just love it. I, I, look, I love it, love it, love it. Pretty sure it's about there. Double check. Oh, I forgot I had me. Oh, that's great. I didn't even realize I had that. I love when that happens. That was 48, so we'll go 50. Right now, I've basically just been leveling up strength and dex for a little while, trying to get it up to where it needs to be. Now I'm at 150. So like I said, I'll probably, I am gonna take it up a little higher because I'd like my faith to be up so I can use a couple magics, um, a couple incantations. All right. Let's see now. Check this out. And then there's a couple like legacy dungeons I have not touched that I'm going to. I do want to get like the Earth, Trade, Earth Trees armor. Um, I'm probably going to upgrade stamina a little bit more. I would like to have that. You know, I, I might go. I, I'm saying 175. I really don't think I want to go more than 175. I think, I feel like that's going to be the new meta. It's probably going to be 170 or something like that. I don't do my, much PvP anyway. It's more for me. But, you know. You know how that goes.
here's a real thing that sucks is I'm trying to remember which way to go up. The, I haven't been up this thing in a while. I, I had it memorized, and now I'm trying to think if... I'm pretty sure... This is the way... I love when they fall. Now... This seems right. Oh! Not that it matters. I still don't like dying. Even if I'm not going to lose a bunch of runes. I just don't want it. I got a good feeling this is the right way. Or the totally opposite way that just kind of ticked me off. I don't remember it being this easy to be, I'm going to be honest with you. It's obviously the right way, but I don't remember it being this easy. Just, just in case. Okay, here we go. Down the what was the other way? Because I know that was the right way. So it's this way, huh? Interesting. Oh, it's split. It's Divine Tower and it's uh, a dungeon. Okay. Really don't remember that being this, but whatever. I do have to say, after the last patch or two, I noticed that the elevators go a lot faster, which is kind of kind of nice. Oh yeah, I can go behind the bestial. There's some uh, good treasure behind the bestial sanctum. Yeah, that looks like legs to me. Just saying. Redon's. Redon's Rune's not bad either. Redon Rune, I forget, it gives you a lot of health or something, I'm pretty sure. We can't, we can't check it here, but it does. It gives you like a lot of health or something like that. Good to have, anyway, just in case. I like plus five with, for everything. I think that works really well. Anytime you get plus five stats for everything, I mean that you just can't beat that, especially with no negative effect, like you know when you're using the right against source seals or America's source seals or any of that stuff. Oh, I just lost an M&M. It's sad. It's sad to lose M&Ms. Cool. So even if the reward isn't great for doing this, which I don't recall if it is or isn't, 
at least it was worth it to get the seal. I'm just going to go ahead and do this. Do I have a... Yeah, I do. I got 60 bigger, so if it says 5... I mean, look at that. Look at all my stats. They all have plus 5 to them right now because I have an Archon right now. That's insane. It's insanely good. That's the reason why I can use a couple of these magics. If I want. I can, heck, I can use a Dragon Magic because of it. That's awesome. That's hard to... Or to sneeze at there. Yeah, that worked out a lot better than last time. Do over. Okay. Now we go this way. As I recall, it's dude, I hate heights. That's okay. I'm supposed to fall, and since it's Radon, it's something to do with gravity and Radon. I know that it um. This is why you don't die there. Gravity doesn't quite work like it should here. Piece of candy. Ooh. They're giving you, I love how they're giving you level two smithing stones of all things, right? Because by now you probably wouldn't need that. But then they're giving you level 12 runes. Like, okay. Thanks a lot. Now you don't jump, you just kind of Fall over. Yep. Okay. And you just fall over. Yep. Okay. You could jump that one, I guess. But this one you gotta jump. Okay. And then oh it like it just gets my heart every time. Every time. I hate height. There we go. Just kind of nix some of the bowl out of it. And we just come over here. And boom. And boom goes the dynamite. There we go. Good times. A little closer. Okay. And we go over. I forget if you. I think we go up here and unlock the door. Because this tower was one of those things, I, I did a walkthrough for it the first time I did it. Second time I had to reference the walkthrough that I used. Um, Fine Cowboy, my boy, he's awesome. He, he, uh, he really helped me through some hard times, some hard souls times. Yep, that's it. There we go. Okay, cool. And since all I used was one blue, I'm not that worried about it. I'll take one blue over one red any day. Yep, it's the cracked one. 
Because I remember there were two cracked ones. Yeah. Ah. ah, I hate this. Just in case so I can see. Nice. And just to show you the rune, so... Yeah, raises... Oh, HP, FP, and stamina. Which, that's... That's nothing to sneeze at, I gotta tell you. I gotta say, that... That'd probably be pretty good. I'm gonna have to try it out sometime. I think I tried it once, and I just... I need the attributes at the time. So I was like, yeah. See, if you get that, you always proc. That's why I have a minimum of 30 stamina. You have to. Kind of nice you can kind of um, keep coming after him. Oh, it's Godskin. you get that extra up nice now I got the the thinner better version of the Godskin apparel because I had the fat one that looks a little bit better um, I wish it did more though wheelers of the god yeah after death of Malekith black blade the source of the power was sealed away yeah but that doesn't that doesn't help. So black flames are essentially like evil, quote unquote, or blasphemous. I guess it, I, I get it. There just should, I feel there should be more weapons and stuff that do stuff like like this actually that I got from EG. Um, actually, like hurts you worse. I think I, I think worn by those who commit high treason. This one or the glass one, I know. It, it just hurts you for wearing it. It's like, okay. Ah, and here's the true prize. Godslayer Greatsword. I think this is the one... Yeah, the Queen's Black Flame. This thing's supposed to be bad ass. The only problem is it needs 20 in fades. Which I only need 5 more in faith. I mean, honestly, I could just as easily, if I was using it instead, raise faith, there's 20, bam, I can use it. I mean, dual handed, not upgraded, is 277. But doing this... That's pretty powerful. And th But that's what my God's Can Peeler does too. And I think this does a better job of it. Because that starts off... Well, it doesn't start off at C, but... Being able to do that... And that, that's pretty good. 448 at 20. Maybe we can go higher too. Just something to think about. Great for the end boss. Great for any god. Nice. Alright, that got done. Now. Scale tunnel. Did I not get the? Oh, guess I didn't get the. Uh, 
I didn't get the thing for that. The oh, I can't. I can never think these things. I never got that for that. All right. Well. I know I beat it. Beat him. I don't think I finished Patch's quest here. Eh. Once this tunnel's done. I got both these. It's yours, Hero's Grave, and the side tomb. That give me oh wow that gave me 113 I didn't see that I'm not gonna use him I may use him nah I may use Tish though I'm not gonna use him either we're dying soldier nah I may use the dolls Notice right, I got a little up. Oh, I can't down here. Oh, this sucks. Yeah, I'm not gonna lose like a hundred and some thousand runes. And we're at 37 minutes, that's not bad. Like I said, at least these elevators are super fast. That's kind of nice. When they're not, they suck. <coughs> yeah, sorry, my throat's been bad too. I've been chewing on candy and lozenges. It has not been fun. I normally don't do that, but I've had a sore throat. I don't know if I... I knew some people that had strep. Oh, yeah, I got to get through the him. There's a lot of stuff left in the Altus I still got to do before this thing. I got to get the grand um, grand thing of sacks, the, the laser, the lightning spear. So I got to grab that. We're going to do that in the next video, probably. Um... Probably should start getting stamina up. I want to be able to use some of this stuff. I mean, not even have to rely on uh, the rune I'm relying on right now. Because Moog's Morag's dead, so I got that done. I got Radon, so no worries on that one. I like that you can turn, so if you're accidentally going like this, oh shoot, I'm going the wrong way. Turn around. You can point it and, and turn around and not fall off the freaking leg. I do like that downward thrust attack too that this has got. It's got a cool, pretty cool downward thrust attack. And yeah, I could get the bird for 10 grand, but I feel like I get more out of this without the fuss and muss. And if I really need, and I'm not quite where I want to be, the red guys are in the corner here. I can lawn mower them for a quick couple grand, like pretty good side hustle.
as you see. I'm able to shut them up pretty fast too. And then I got 156. Bam, done. That's 56,000 rune. Well, 46,000 runes I just got. And I need 53, so that's pretty good. Uh, let's see now. Now that's getting down to where it's not giving me as much. We should start putting in to... I want Faith to go up too so I can use some things. Endurance. Endurance could use a good pop-up too. 2.3 pounds. Yeah, let's get that in there. Because once this rune's gone... Because I got, what? I got 13 of those bad boys left. And I hate, I hate scavenging for runes. It's just such a bitch. I've tried the large rats. Yeah, there's some good spots. I just, I don't... I don't find them easy. And I don't do PvP very much. So it makes things just suck. <laughs> to try to do. It really does. There's still some memory slots I haven't even gotten to. All kinds of crazy stuff. So where are we going? Oh yeah, we're going over here. Heroes Crave. Get some legacy dungeons done. That'd be nice. Alright. Yeah, it's always best to ignore guys that can do that to you. Cool death, though. Not a bad death. pretty much take care of those jigs. Down there, don't worry. Holy ground. And the tree sentinels. Awesome. And now you don't have any worries. You can go do what you need to do. Well, let's see. Tree sentinel stuff. Does have more boys. A 
Bearing fire by a lot. Bearing lightning by not too much. Holy yes. Wow, that's actually really cool. I'm digging that. And I can wear it. That's great. Just not the helmet. I can't do the helmet. I did this for medium load. But I want I want the uh, ability. This is actually kind of cool. I never really worn this, been able to wear it before. Well, I never had, oops, I hit my mic. I never been able to have, um, fix this here. I've never been able to have this high of stamina before, but this is actually really cool. Now, is this? Back the way I came? I don't even know. Oh yeah, that's the way I came. Oh. Man, using Margaret's shackle for this is awesome. It's kind of nice because this, uh, the Giza's wheel kind of goes with it. I mean, the white mask is the only thing that's a little off, and I don't mind that at all. Yeah, yeah, I'm not worried about you guys. Should not be worried about cult skeletons. And I'm not. Gotcha. Got him. Got the other crucible set. Nice. Done. Done. Man. This this weapon just kills. Love it. I gotta be honest, for a legacy dungeon, they weren't worth that many. 30 grand, that was nothing. For a legacy dungeon? Come on now. Come on now. I've never been able to to beat this so fast as I have today using Margaret's shackle. That's awesome. Highly recommend using it. 
makes this aggravating dungeon way less aggravating. But we still got a little left to go. So I'm hoping this is it. It is. I gotta check up here because there was somewhere I know I could have gone a little further on those beams I'm pretty sure and this is walking me way further up and this is a really long ladder really digging the cave by the way okay yeah that's all right, that's back that way no I mean got a gray violet that's cool I'm really glad I went into this dungeon because this armor is going to be awesome. And this armor, by the way, I mean, if you look at it, the specs for fire are wonderful. Holy are awesome and immunity is really good. So, and still with a high defense, this is going to be great. So, yep, yeah, see, there's one more to do. Okay. anything else to go all the way over here I wish I could remember what some of this stuff is ah oh, no way That's what destroyed it. This is where you would have had to go to destroy it. So that's how you can do it the normal way. Well, we're just about out of time anyway. But that pretty much showed everything we needed there. Yeah. 
there's much more to this. I don't think. Yeah, this is the other way up to it. Okay, so we've pretty much gone around every which way we could go. To get to where we need to, so you can get the Ur Trees armor. I don't think there's anything else down here that I can remember. That's a little piece of candy right there. That was from killing him. Oh, here we go. Wow! Proc the heck out of him like that. Bam. So here you go, the cube crucible feather talisman. Uh, which does if I, I don't remember it. Improves dodge roll but increases damage taken. So there you go. Wait, what? Oh shoot, I've been having <laughs> I forgot to put um Blood loss in the vicinity increases attack power. Forgot about you using that. But at any rate, so you get this. I don't know. Yeah, it does seem a little faster. But eh. I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't bank on it. Especially if it's doing less damage. Or, or things are doing more damage to you. Fuck that. Not interested. So thanks a lot, guys. Like and subscribe helps out the channel. Uh, we're trying to get to 100 subs here. We're pretty close. We're at 77. Oh, uh, yeah. That's not going to help either. Uh, at any rate, we're at 77. So we appreciate everything everyone's done. The, uh, the outpour of people subbing and liking has been great. Um, check out my V Rising video. I have that out, and yeah, you know, I might do some videos for it if anyone's interested. It's for PS5, but it's been out quite a bit. I figured no one really wanted it. That's why I said, you know, if you want to, cool. If you're not, cool. All right, thanks a lot, guys, and I'll catch you in the next one. Stay classy. Taco Monkey is out.